Hey guys, uh, Gabe here, Base BJJ, Coach Greg. Um, for my fundamentals class and my kids class, you guys are going to watch the same video. Um, even my advanced guys, watch this video if you'd like. Uh, it's not going to hurt you. Um, all, of, all we're going to work on is uh, traditional arm bar from closed guard. And then um, we're going to go to the back take from closed guard. It's very simple, but very effective. And uh, like I said, uh, it's, it's a basic technique, but it's, it's one that you'll probably use for, for here, from here on out. So here we go. You always want to control the sleeves. So now what we're going to do is you have the option to attack. You know, we're square, they're square. I'm always attacking this side, so you want to cross grip it, okay? You want to cross grip the, the sleeve, okay? Take a, take a good grip on that cup of the, the sleeve. Not inside, guys. We're going to go on the outside. We're going to roll it, okay? And then we're going to bring our knees to our chest and have his hand placed right here in the collarbone, collarbone area, right in there, okay? As soon as he's there, you're going to just squeeze down your elbow to your ribs, right? This hand that's uh, free, that's on the outside, your, which is my left hand, it's going to go across his body. So you're going to cross his body, okay? You're going to go there. You're going to break his shoulder down, okay? So the same side that you're attacking, that foot is going to go on the hip, okay? Not on the mat, because they can step over, but we want to go on the hip, and you want to squeeze your knee uh, on his shoulder, right? So... Now what we're going to do is we're going to push with the same foot on the hip. We're going to push our head towards um, his uh, knee on the other side. Okay, so but as we're moving our head, this leg is going to go super high right on the armpit area. Okay, just like this. Okay, you want to take a good bite of that shoulder blade, the, low, the upper part of his back, maintaining this control here. That creates the angle for your leg to clear across his face, okay? I prefer you guys not to cross your feet at the top because you can get stacked, okay? There's not a whole lot of pressure. Then he gets out of the arm bar, right? So if we're here, again, we're crossing, break the shoulder down, foot on the hip, lock his shoulder in with your knee, big bite right there, step over, Take a bite with your heels, okay? So imagine your heels going towards your butt, your hamstring area, and you're just squeezing his body with your heels, okay? Now we're gonna release the shoulder, wrist control, and then we're gonna drive our hips up to the ceiling and pull down on the wrist, and we get the tap. So we're here, okay? Cross grip, remember the cross grip. We're gonna, if he has a good grip on your, your lapel, you're gonna pop that grip up, okay, with the the free hand, pop it up, okay, bring your knees to your chest, and hold, hold here, his shoulder's already there, so you're going to break it down, just hold it down, you can grab the cloth if you want, this foot, that's the same side you're attacking the arm on, is going to go on the hip, and then we're going to squeeze his shoulder, and we're going to drive our head to his knee, right there, okay, we want a huge bite on that shoulder blade, okay, cross, don't cross your feet, but we want our heels going to the mat, okay? Let go of the shoulder, hand on the wrist, make sure his thumb is pointing up. We drive our hips to the ceiling, we pull down on the wrist, and we get the tap, okay? One more time. So we're here, we pop that grip up to there, okay? You don't want to go too high, then you won't have a whole lot of room. You want to keep it right here. Okay, there, foot on the hip, big turn, your cap is across the shoulder blades, you step over, let go of the shoulder, control the wrist, make sure the thumb is pointing up, and we get the tap. Alright, one of the things that um, I see sometimes that goes on is you're here, you get it, right? then you, you get lazy with this leg, you keep it down here, and you want to cross there. All, right, all he's going to do is push my knee down and escape, okay? So don't get lazy with that trail foot, that trail leg. Make sure it's up high. 
All right, guys, so that's the uh, fundamentals technique and the kids' technique, so you guys work on that. Um, if you have any questions, any comments, anything we need to work on to help you guys, we're more than happy to do so. So other than that, guys, we'll see you guys soon. Miss you. Love you.